In this video, we're going to show you how to replace a lower control arm on your Hyundai Sonata. Let's get started. Using a 21 millimeter socket, remove the five lug nuts. Remove the wheel, remove the cotter pin, using a 17 millimeter wrench on the front and the back side, we're going to hold the head of the bolt and loosen the nut. Remove the nut. We're going to thread the nut on a few threads. We're going to hit the bolt with a hammer. We put the nut on so we don't mushroom the head of the bolt. Remove the bolt. Using a pry bar and a hook, I'm going to hook over the control arm. We're going to pry down pulling the ball joint out of the knuckle. Using a small wedge, we're going to go in between this coupler for the ball joint stud. Pull the ball joint out of the knuckle, swing into the knuckle to the side, using a 19 millimeter wrench to hold the nut. We're going to use a 19 millimeter socket to remove the bolt. Remove the nut. Remove the bolt. Using a 17 millimeter, we're going to remove the front bolt for the control arm. Using a pry bar and a hammer, we're going to tap the bolt out. Remove the bolt. Remove the control arm. Get the control arm started in the back first. using a screwdriver to help me align the holes in the rear of the control arm. Using a hammer, hit the bolt up, get it fully seated, then get the nut started on top.
get the front of the control arm seated in the front bracket. Using a punch, I'm going to help line up the holes in the front for the control arm. Get the bolt started. Snug the bolt down. I'm going to pull the ball joint stud towards me. We're going to pull down and then pull the knuckle in. Install the ball joint into the knuckle. Get the ball joint fully seated. Install the washer and install the nut. Torque the ball joint bolt to 80 foot pounds. Before torquing the control arm bolts, the car should be on the ground and the suspension should be in a loaded state. To simulate this, we're going to use a jack under the ball joint. We're going to jack the knuckle up about where it sits when it's on the ground. Right about there. And now we can torque our control arm bolts. Torque the front control arm bolt to 110 foot-pounds. Holding the nut up top, torque the rear control arm bolt to 80 foot-pounds. Remove the jack out from under the vehicle. Install the wheel. Get the lug nuts started. Snug them down. Torque the lug nuts to 80 foot-pounds in a star pattern. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.